Welcome to the Ghost Bikes video instruction series. In this video, we want to explain to you our AMR pack system, an outstanding bike pack system. AMR handlebar pack, packing options. In dry conditions, there is no need to use the dry bag. Still, you should keep it inside on long trips, just in case it starts raining. Store your belongings directly inside the outer bag. Compress the pack to push the air out and start rolling its end over itself. Secure the buckles at the sides as shown in order to keep the bag closed. In rainy conditions, store your belongings inside the dry bag. Compress the dry bag to push the air out and roll its end over itself. Secure the hook and loop tape straps to its end to keep it closed. Store the dry bag inside the outer bag and repeat the closing steps. Compress the pack to push the air out and start rolling it. This delivers a double wall that keeps your belongings perfectly sealed. Secure the buckles at the sides as shown in order to keep the bag closed. If you are looking for a combination of both worlds, fast but still waterproof, connect the inner dry bag to the outer dry bag using the hook and loop tape usually used for closing them. Open the dry bag and fold its end so that the hook and loop tape lays in the outside. Align the dry bag's red handle to the outer bag's red handle and attach the hook and loop tapes all over the end. It is possible to attach the bags and pack them afterwards, as well as changing the setup on the go as shown here. Furthermore, it is your own decision whether you close both sides in the same way or not, also based on the item stored on each side and the need or not to access it fast. As with other setups, compress the bag and roll the end over itself. Secure the buckles at the sides as shown in order to keep the bag closed. Assembling to the bike. The AMR handlebar pack depends on the handlebar straps in order to be attached. Choose them accordingly to your handlebar's diameters, being the short ones for mounted bikes and the long ones for road bikes. Attach them so that the blue strap stays on top and the loop pulled through the plastic ring points towards the riding direction. Place the AMR handlebar pack on top of the front wheel with the ghost lettering readable from the front of the bike. Attach the hooks on the gray straps to the handlebar's strap loops. On the first attempt, don't go over the cables but under them and do not tighten them yet. Now attach the red strap that must go around the fork crown and beneath the down tube. Tighten it firmly. Now tighten the two gray straps attached to the handlebar straps and judge whether they would interfere less when placed over them or not. Avoid straps to cable contact as much as possible, as well as forcing the cables in order to place the bags. Especially place the straps over the cables if one cable is going between the strap and the hook, as this would make it loose very soon. AMR Accessory Pocket Packing Options The AMR Accessory Pocket comes with a rain cover that can be used as a stuff sack as well. Put it over the pack and cinch the cord. The small opening will be kept on the downside when the bag is attached to the AMR handlebar pack. Store your belongings inside the rain cover and put it inside the accessory pocket when using the navigation pocket or if you want to take your belongings while leaving the bag on the bike. Assembly to the bike. Detach the buckles on the front of the AMR handlebar pack and attach the AMR accessory pocket. If you are already using those straps to store something, detach and reattach one side at a time. Tighten the lower straps when finished in order to keep the AMR accessory pocket firmly in place. Now use the handlebar straps to keep it close to the handlebar. Pull the blue strap from the handlebar straps through the blue strap on the AMR accessory pocket and secure it using the hook and loop tape. The extra storage from the AMR handlebar pack can still be used when AMR accessory pocket is attached. 
Open the zipper and place your navigation device inside the pocket with the screen visible through the plastic. Detach the hook and loop tape straps and reattach them beneath the stem. This will keep the device visible and steadily in place when riding, and you can even charge it while riding by using the plug.